हेलो एवरी वन हाउ आर यू आई होप यू आर डूइंग वेल वेलकम ऑल इन दिस न्यू वीडियो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल ट्राई टू इंस्टॉल एनाकोंडा ऑन ओबन टू ट्वेंटी टू पॉइंट जीरो फोर सो फर्स्ट आई विल ओपन दिस माइक्रोसॉफ्ट एज दैट इज माई ब्राउजर एंड आई विल सर्च फॉर द इंस्टॉल एनाकोंडा ऑन ओबन टू ट्वेंटी टू आई विल हिट रन एंड देन आई विल सर्च फॉर द ऑफिशियल वेबसाइट ऑफ द एनाकोंडा सो दिस इज द ऑफिशियल वेबसाइट सो आई विल क्लिक ऑन दिस लिंक नाउ हियर इज द प्रोसीजर हाउ टू इंस्टॉल एनाकोंडा ऑन ओबन टू ट्वेंटी टू पॉइंट जीरो फोर दैट इज द लिनक्स सो फर्स्ट वी नीड टू इंस्टॉल दिस dependencies so i will copy and then i will go to my terminal and i will do sudo and then i will paste whatever i have copied from the website so this will install all these dependencies on my ubuntu it is asking for the password because i have used sudo there so i will put my password there and it will automatically install everything i will put here y for continuing so i will just write y and then enter so it is fetching and downloading so it has been fetched and downloaded and uh, you might wonder why i copied this one so since ubuntu is debian based kernel so this is why i use this debian one dependencies so if you are using red hat then you should copy this one and if you are using other linux kernels then you should copy with respect to yours but talking about ubuntu so ubuntu is debian based kernel so this is why i copied this one now the next step is download anaconda installer for linux so i will click on this button and then i will download from here so it will download the anaconda installer so it is around 1 gb so it will take a bit time now you can see my anaconda installer is about to complete so it will be downloaded in some seconds so now what i will do i will just go back and i will get to this installation page and second what i have to do i have to uh, verify the installer's data integrity with ssh256 for that you just have to run this command on your terminal so Uh, i will show you how how to do that first i will copy this command and i will paste it into my text editor if you do like this this will be easy for you so there you have to uh, replace your uh, installation path and file name so you can see our uh, installation file has been downloaded so i will go to go to the downloads on my system and you can see uh, here it is so this is the uh, this is the file and i will go to the properties and i will just copy it the file path and the name i will paste the path here and the name should be this so you have to do same so this is my command which i need to run on my terminal so you can see sh sum minus a 256 so it is exactly what here they have shown so i will just copy this command and open my terminal so this is my terminal i will just make it larger so i will just paste here so this is the command which i need to run 
I pressed enter so it is very fine so if you get like this so it has been verified now the next step is if you are using python 3.7 then you need to run this bash minus downloads then the file name so i will again uh, copy this and i will open this my text editor and i will paste here so i just need to uh, copy my file name here and replace it okay so now you can see i have uh, i have replaced my original file name with the given in the website so the file name in the website is the old one but i need to replace with my own which i have downloaded so now if i run this second command that is bash minus downloads then file name so it will further so it will further uh, so if i run this this command so this will verify the bash here now you can see uh, i need to press enter to continue so i will again enter continue i will again enter to continue i will again enter to continue i will again enter to continue you just have to enter slowly because there is something which will come and you need to give the permission there so i will enter slowly slowly so i am just pressing enter only nothing else so once again enter 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 now i need to accept the license term so for that i i need to write s then enter now it will ask to confirm the location where anaconda will be installed so i will press enter to confirm the location because i want to install the anaconda on the path where it is has been given here so the path will be home then slash then my username then this will be the file name where the anaconda will be installed so i will again press enter to confirm the location so i have press enter now it is unpacking and installing the anaconda so it will install all the things which are necessary to run the anaconda properly so you need to wait for some times here now you can see downloading and extracting the packages is being done for the base environment so it will take a bit more time now it's done so do you want the installer to initialize anaconda 3 by running conda init yes i will say yes so i will write yes and enter now you can see it's showing thank you for installing anaconda 3 that means my anaconda has been installed properly now to open anaconda i will write anaconda init first it is showing command not found i will close the terminal 
and once again i op i will open the terminal now you can see it is showing base here first firstly it was not showing here something like this so now if i write anaconda minus navigator and press enter then it will open my anaconda which is which i just been installed on my ubuntu 22.04 so you can see my anaconda has been installed here so you can see my environment is base here obviously you can create some more environment according to your project and uh, one more thing you can do here like uh, if you want to update the anaconda navigator as you can see there is a update for the anaconda so you can click on yes and it will quit the anaconda navigator and then update the anaconda automatically you do not need to do anything here it will automatically update now if you have any doubts please let me know in the comment section thank you